from the inside, Effie Young at Arkansas, then Ford of Southern California, then Wilson in five, and Talitha digs in six, and Diggs is out. Well, she's a world-class 60-meter runner and a 200-meter runner. Nobody in this field has the same speed as she has in the 200 meters, and that certainly gives her an advantage here on the first lap. Wilson has the strength, though, but Diggs is going to get the pole easily. Well, Chris Johnson said he wanted his Razorbacks to run clean races. He just wanted Britton Wilson to be in a position to attack, and she's in great position right now. And she is making the move on the backstretch. She's got to pass here if she's going to have a chance, and she does it cleanly. And Diggs doesn't seem to have an answer. The turnover is not there. And you can see her huffing and puffing. It's going to be Britton Wilson win this section. Now, does she run fast enough to win the title? Oh, my goodness! From the inside, Chandler of Southern Cal, Mays of Oregon, then Ophelia of LSU, and Alfred of Texas. Well, Julian Alfred really took off hard in that first 50 meters. Now, one thing we need to keep an eye on Julian Alfred as she begins to tire a little bit. She really loses her technique, so let's keep an eye on her technique down the stretch. Texas really needs her points, and she is holding off favor Ophelia. Alfred is a double winner. So very close between SC leading and Kentucky. These are Miles poised to make a move, but Chantasia Jones doesn't want to give it up. USC and Kentucky. Time to beat 330.09, and SC is going to win it and establish the new time to beat, 328.57, and that's under their season best. Told it's a lane violation for UCLA's disqualification from that first section. USC hands off first. Oh, I know that. I know that we've got the right guy there. That's Johnny Blockberger, son of Sheldon Blockberger, pretty decent multi-eventer in his day. And Baylor making a move with Matthew Moore. He was second or third overall in the open 400. And for the Sun Devils, that's Justin Robinson getting them trying to get them back into contention. Well, keep an eye on Robinson in the back of the pack there. He's running on the outside. He's got a long ways to go. Oh, no. Blockberger gets tripped up by Oklahoma's Missouri Matar. Really lost stride there. Can he hang on and come through victorious? No. For Oklahoma, they will win the section in 302-98 unofficially. 